watching television all day, trying to keep up with the results of the election. We are voting, and of course, the vote of the people is what we are expecting for you to stand. Okay, but I see what they are telling us now that it's not what we voted for. Some places are rigged, some people are snatching ballot boxes some uh, what do you call it what's the name of that machine uh, reverse machine no longer working now they are collecting manually and the results are coming out and it's not really making sense to me it's not making sense to anyone and then uh, whether we like it or not a lot of anxieties in the air a lot of anger frustration in the air and I can't help but say that it has gotten a little toll on me and uh, I just decided to share my own aspect with, with you guys and uh, to also check in on you how are you holding in Nigeria where you, wherever you are how are you holding please let me know in the comment section I decided not to I don't want to you know like anxiety is coming but of course by the grace of God, we are overcoming it with prayer, with a lot of hope. And uh, when I was praying this morning, I heard in my dream about the northern kings that were conquered by the people of Israel. And it gave me a lot of hope because God told Joshua that he was going to deliver them from the hands of the northern kings. And, uh, it gave me a lot of hope that Nigeria is going to be delivered from bad leadership. But during the day again, and I saw that I was becoming anxious again. I was becoming anxious and I'm like, hi, this thing. So I realized that this time is the time for us to be hopeful, to keep praying, to keep praying that the will of God be done, that the counsel of God should prevail. And let the God of day leader come to power. The Bible said that we should not be anxious. We should not be anxious. With prayer and supplication and thanksgiving, we should let our petitions go to God. And the God that gives peace will give us peace. And I am holding on to that scripture. And I am holding on to it. And I am believing. And I am hopeful that. We are going to triumph in everything. We are going to be triumphant in everything. And uh, I hope that you are praying. I hope that you are not losing hope. You are not losing faith. You keep praying. Keep holding on to God. Because Nigeria, we are going to be great again. We are going to be great again. Um, a few tips on how to. This is not time for us to negative comment it's not a time for you to waste energy it's time for you to settle your energy on positive things on the will of God on prayer on hope hope is everything God is not open he's not done with Nigeria God is not done with Nigeria we are we are we are going to come out victorious that's just all I have to say and also I am also encouraging myself too <laughs> because the thing is, is so so in fact I in fact I just want to tell myself I'm going to put on the television after this because it's well in Jesus' name. <laughs> so um I'm going to go to the kitchen and see if I can do all the good things and then I'll go back up again and do some prayers. I'll just share with you just a mini deal of just to see what I'm doing. Um, the tea I take mostly that calms me down. Uh, my pineapple bag tea, I'm going to share it with you. And, uh, it's what I take almost every day. Uh, after my prayer, after my Bible study, I go to pray and hope that this tea also is going to add to one of the things that is going to calm me from all that is happening. So let's go to the kitchen and do one of the things, okay? Any brave set of people that I know in this life is Nigerians. 
very brave set of people. Don't joke with Nigerians. Yeah? The voice of the people will always stand. You see what they were doing in Abuja? Uh, the, uh, the, where they went and stood in front of my neck and said that they, they must, must yeah. that they must vote. In my own holy unit, what happened was they didn't come to 11 30. When they even came, they said give us a spot. All of us started patiently we were waiting, waiting, waiting. So this is what I'm going this pineapple, I'm going to pick it now. I will not use it too, because this one I want to use it. Now beaver did not work. And we're going to our own with the man. Something they spent. Did you understand? So, my dear, it's well over. Nigerians are brave. Though. Nigerians have anything they want, they'll get. Yeah. I, I don't judge anybody that voted for any other person, but me, I think it's clear who we want our leader to be. We know who we want, and we, we must get, we, we, we are strongly fine for who we want. You know, although it's not impersonal, although people say, uh, why are you voting? It's not something we should vote against each other. But think about it now. For the past how many years have we had it so well with us? The same set of people are ruling. Leave it alone. Give us victory. Oh, oh give us victory. Because I want to boil it. That's why I wash because the, the major nutrient is inside the back of this pineapple. That's why I'm trying to wash the bath very well so that and the vinegar water is also going to do going to do justice to it. See that? See that? I'll just wash it again. This uh, 
connections, God that will help us. Amen. The castle of God will stand. I saw it on posting, they didn't make me laugh. You know the man is so calm. Yes, ma'am. He said he did a visit. He said nobody should protest. He said we should not protest, and we're not going to protest. We are listening to our leader. They are very obedient. But they are still protesting. They cannot protest. So the God will give them. They will have the peace in Jesus' name. They need to come and bring this thing to calm down. This thing is the only thing that will calm them down. You there are talking, did you vote? Who did you vote for? So now, we just uh, cut this tea like this. Just put it here. Our pots like this. The magic is to, I don't know if the magic, the miracle that this tea used to do. This house and testify to this. Let's say, give me water or a bag. Water, water, water. Anytime the children are disturbing our food, yes. Come and drink. Come and drink. Nigerians should even try this. More than this. Yes, sir. Very well. Accept it very well like this. Give me ginger for some for some effects. It will no, this is water. Or for all states. Eh? I was really disappointed. Big way, Sha. Big way. This one, they are so, not hungry now, they're the food basket. Uh, is that why they did that? Food is everywhere. After all the this thing they said they were going to do. I'm officially a, an indigenous of Plateau State now. <laughs> That's what I am right now. I'm officially a Plateau State. I'm from Plateau. I'll change my name now. Uh, yeah, you are still even Nigerian. I'm Nigerian, but I'm from Plateau. See what Plateau did now. <laughs> Very good. See what Plateau did. Last slide. But although I still love my language, I'm just, they got you, they know, they know, they know for my hand. Ah, they, they, they really did something for the first time. Uh, they know for my hand at all. Eh? Calm you down. So does it go there? It calms you down, make you regular, make you sleep well, you know. Your hair is going already. Now skip the lemon, you know that I'm a, a lemon fan. Wow. Hey. Me? Who yeah. would think I'm more super woman, Sha? Yes, I'll do only one hand like this one. Am I not? Yeah, can you stretch the Hey. Well, do to do two hundred. We boil it for let's say thirty minutes or so. Let's say 